everybody, this is Praxis, and today I'm just working for a couple of hours. It's kind of a tying up loose ends kind of day. There's a couple of reasons for that. One, at the time of this recording, it's Christmas Eve, and I don't want to spend the whole day here. I want to spend more time with the family at the end of the day after lunch. Uh, and also, I really got kind of beat up on the roof. You guys remember yesterday, it was very uncomfortable. I thought that my legs would be really sore, uh, you know, from being splayed out across the roof, but really, I I kind of pulled something between my shoulder blades. I think just because I was so uncomfortable towards the end, actually really closer to halfway through, uh, you know when you see like an injured animal and their their muscles are all kind of twitching and shaking? My Both my legs actually were like, because it was so uncomfortable up there, started just uncontrollably shaking about halfway through. I It was getting rough towards the end and I ended up really smashing my finger here. I broke the thumbnail and uh, it really hurt. Uh, <laughs> I hit it a couple more times after that too. Um, so I'm just, I'm feeling a little bit in rough shape today. So taking a little bit of a slower day today. But one reason I definitely wanted to come here today was because I wanted to check this. I've got a dehumidifier. Uh, we've got a uh, electric heater across the back. Well, that's not permanent, just being hung there temporarily. Heat up the space. Got a couple of small space heaters here, and I wanted to see if the dehumidifier had started actually capturing moisture. Uh, the thing with at least most dehumidifiers that I'm familiar with is until you get them up to a cer certain temperature, and that seems like it's around like maybe 55 degrees or so, they won't uh, extract any moisture from the air. Uh, so we were just trying to get this place warm enough so this thing could start working, and then once it is working, it's generating its own heat too, so it's adding to the warmth. So I got here this morning, the uh, little bucket in the bottom of this thing was full, that's great, I dumped it, I got it running again, so uh, so that was good, that was kind of the primary reason I wanted to make sure I came here today, is to see if it's working, and if it was, I could dump the bucket. Uh, so it's going, it is getting close to 60 degrees in here, I'm actually kind of sweaty, uh, but I've spent the day just uh, doing a little bit more spray foam around the windows. I realized on these windows outside, we put in a minimal number of nails to hold them in, uh, in the interest of just kind of getting as many windows in as we could. Uh, so I went out and got the rest of the nails in there, and that's pretty much it today. Just odds and ends, tying up some loose ends, and you know, making sure that this thing is going. Uh, to, obviously, since today is Christmas Eve, tomorrow's Christmas, I'm not going to be working tomorrow, but this thing will be, uh, at least until its bucket fills up. I thought about running a hose out of it, because you can attach a hose to it, and this behind you would actually be a great place to drop it. This is the, oh, you know what? You know what I could do? Now that I'm talking out loud here, um, I was thinking I could run, this is going to be gray water, it goes out, but I didn't want to punch a hole through the wall up there, because gray water is kind of secret. I could run the dehumidifier into the pipes that are coming up out of the, uh, the slab over here. For that matter, this one right here, these are just the drainage pipes that run out to uh, the septic system. Ugh. I wish I brought a hose for it now. Maybe, it, maybe I'll do it tomorrow on the way out. We'll just do a little bit of work on Christmas. <laughs> That's it. Thanks for watching.